And I've come to the realization recently that omitting the truth is the very same thing as lying. truth has to be put out there like it has to be put out because you don't you have, what's the alternative right withholding the truth is the exact same thing as lying yeah and it's like do you want to live a lie or do you want to live in truth and there's really no in between yeah like there's there's literally no in between and when you start thinking about that then it puts everything in this perspective of like seeking the truth in all areas of your life, mm -hmm. um, which is a very interesting place to be, but it's a very um, growth mindset. It's a very, it's a very expansive place to be mentally. To me, it's just about living in truth. Uh, I did a podcast with this guy um, who now I hired as a coach. Uh, his name's Sean Whalen. And I had him on the podcast and I asked, hey, what's one thing you quit doing that enables you to succeed? It's like a question I always ask these people. And he said, lying. I said, about what? He said, everything. I was like, jeez. He's like, everything. He's like, I lied to, to everyone about everything. And it was just that idea, that whole thing. Like, yeah, I'm doing great, doing great. How are you? I'm fine, great, awesome. And he had a gun in his mouth one night and, and realized that like none of this stuff matters. It's all about living in truth. And, there's a, that's a lot to unpack, um, but this idea of, of not just living in truth when it's comfortable, but always telling the truth. And so with a lot of my content lately that we've been putting out, like I've been exposing a lot of stuff uh, about myself that hasn't been comfortable uh, to put out there, but by doing so, now the messages that I'm receiving, now the conversations that I'm having with people are so much more real and so much more impactful. It's the most liberating to live in truth. You know, what's that Mark Twain quote of, um, if you always tell the truth, you never have to worry about what you say. Like it's just the it's just the greatest feeling of all time, just to live in it, just to put it all out there, and and not and you'll never not care what others think, but not let the opinions of others affect your actions and what you're going to do in uh, anyway. And man, it's just been the most Im impacting. It's been the biggest impact that I've that I've made on myself. And then I've seen it play out with others, and it's just all I want to do now. So it's all I want to do, like to the point where I, I weirdly want bad things to happen, even though I don't want to experience it, just because I want to be able to go through it in a public way, so that people can be, that people can benefit from watching me work through it. Um, and I know that that will happen. Like to me, the, whatever's about to happen to the economy over the next couple of years is going to be the greatest opportunity ever for people to finally get real and transparent and document the decline and the rise back up. And I hope people do it. Many won't. Uh, most won't. But like that's the stories that people need to see. I love how Gary says, the truth is undefeated. The truth is undefeated.